I already know these are gonna be so freaking popular. Oh my gosh, I'm really impressed with these from the dollar spot. Target is getting ready for Mother's Day in the dollar spot. I have been looking everywhere, but this has everything you need in it and these products are amazing. Hello everyone, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando. I make all shopping and shop with me videos, home decor and home decorating videos. I love shopping at all my favorite stores like Target, TJ Maxx, Walmart, Home Goods, Kirkland's, World Market, Joanne Fabrics, Michaels. I totally just like said Joanne Flabrics, but that's fine. Anyways, I love shopping at all of my favorite stores to show you what is new. Any sales or clearance deals I think you may want to be aware of and tons and tons of seasonal decor. Today is Tuesday, which on my channel, if you did not know, can only mean one thing. Today is Target Tuesday. On Tuesdays, I shop all around Target to show you what is new in the entire store. We always hit up the Target dollar spot. I love checking out the home decor section, but I love highlighting all of the new collections. Target always has so many new products so if you can't make it to the stores very often make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can learn about what is new every single week at Target of course while you are down there please be sure to give the video a big thumbs up and after you hit the subscribe button you can also hit the notification bell and YouTube will notify you every single time I put out a new video on Monday Tuesday Friday and Saturday the day you are watching this we actually got the keys to our new house so we are really 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 excited about it go ahead and put a key emoji in the comments below if you are excited as well there's an empty house tour that's gonna be coming at the end of this week and so many makeover videos there's a lots of like planning that I'm doing right now like decor planning working with lots of fun brands so definitely make sure you are subscribed if you haven't hit the subscribe button yet so you don't miss out on all that new home decorating content that is coming over the next few months in today's Target Tuesday like I mentioned we will of course check out the Target dollar spot and see what's new over there we're just gonna work our way all around the store but if you're excited to see what is new this week at Target then just keep watching because we're gonna head inside right now. It is Target Tuesday. It's just the best day. Expect more, pay less. I almost said expect less, pay more. First off, we are gonna look at a bunch of new stuff in the dollar spot. Some of it you can actually see right behind me. Really, really cute new like stands and just kitchen type items. Lots of new items over here in the dollar spot, so let's dive in. Even with there already being a bunch of new stuff out, they still have a bunch of new stuff to stock. So this is why I have to touch on the dollar spot every single week because they are just pumping new stuff out. First up is this. I'm just gonna grab this little stack. New wood risers here in the dollar spot. Look how adorable these are. Oh my gosh, these would be really cute plant stands as well. They do have two different heights and two different colors. So they have the shorter one. This one is $3 and they have it with either white legs or with black legs. Then for $5, they have a taller, bigger version. Same either white legs or black legs on this. But these are $5 a piece. These are honestly such a good dupe for these little Serena and Lily like plant stand stools. Really honestly similar concept for $5 dollars compared to like a hundred dollars but these are really really nice you can find something similar to these also at like TJ Maxx and home goods but these are even cheaper than that so honestly kudos to Target for jumping on the trend and doing it much cheaper because these are super super cute personally I would use these for like a little mini plant stand or something I just think they would add a little bit of like I don't know, like an aesthetic flair to any plant, especially if it had a more simple pot. I really, really like these. And the big ones, like I said, are five, and the small ones are three. I showed these last week, but they do have two different sizes of these wire bins, the bigger one and a smaller one. They have really big holes, but someone messaged me on Instagram, and they had put like fake lemons inside, or it might have been real lemons, but I think it was faux lemons and then decor on top, and it looked really, really adorable. So that's definitely another idea of what you can do with these, because I was pretty stumped but that's one thing that you can do with them new from the pets collection we've seen a lot of this but this is really adorable you can hang it up and put like their leashes on it or something we have three dogs so this would actually be so perfect this is five dollars look at this stackable swivel tray perfect for jewelry maybe even jewelry like on the go this is three bucks I really like this this is so cool they have this new book caddies you can put little like children's books in here you could also use this as like a mail organizer there's tons of different things you could use this for like kids pouches maybe like fruit snacks something like that like taller snacks granola bars so you could definitely use this for pantry organization as well but they have it shown as a book caddy and it is five dollars a new dish towel wow it actually says mom so 
Target is getting ready for Mother's Day in the dollar spot. So adorable, just has it in these really pretty florals and then it comes with this pink or like dusty rose colored floral towel as well. You get both of those for $5. These are so nice, it is framed artwork so you get two sister prints in this really neutral frame and they do have a kickstand. I'm wondering if you can hang them as well but you do get both sizes for $5. This is super nice. These are seriously perfect to add into a gallery wall. I already know these are gonna be so freaking popular. These are new glass canisters. They are $5 a piece, but they have this really pretty neutral colored lid. These would be great for pantry organization. This would be great for like coffee beans or granola or something like that. That would be so good in here. Oh my gosh, I wonder if we can find other sizes. Okay, dollar spot. Oh my gosh, you can see the reflection of my new cup. I actually got this here at Target at the Starbucks, which I call Tarbucks because it's Starbucks inside of Target. Isn't this so pretty? Like I needed another cup. If you didn't know, I collect a lot of Starbucks cups. But anyways, back to this. These are so heavy. I was so confused about what they were at first. They are slate serving boards. I don't want to drop it because I feel like it would break for sure. Also like, hi, you can totally see me in the reflection. These are so nice. They're like stone serving boards and they have them in this like rectangle shape. And then they also have a round one. These are really, really nice and sleek, super modern. Great for like a cheese board, like any type of serve board, but especially I feel like a charcuterie board or a cheese board would be really nice on these. I wish you could like see the texture. I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see it because of the plastic. These are really nice and they have this really, really cool raw edge. Oh my gosh, I'm really impressed with these from the dollar spot. Adorable garden shovels. Look at these, these are super nice. They are made out of metal. These are $3 a piece. They have this really adorable like sage and white polka dot one. And then they also have this florally one that matches some of the like dish towels that we've looked at. Like this is a popular pattern from their new spring collection. These are so nice. I wonder if they're gonna end up having more gardening tools. Oh, this might be one of the first wedding items from the dollar spot. They always do a wedding collection in the dollar spot every single spring, and I feel like that's exactly what this is supposed to be for. So it's a dry erase, like hashtag sign. So you can add your hashtag, and immediately I think wedding hashtags, since those have been really popular over the last few years. But yeah, oh my gosh, the new wedding collection is gonna be coming out soon, and I think this might be the first item. These are super nice. New food storage containers, and they're actually glass. These are $5 a piece. They have this like pretty like leafy design on the front. They come in round for five bucks. I'm not sure if that's like a great deal for five dollars. I don't know, I feel like you can get like a set or maybe maybe we would need to like compare over to the kitchen section but I love that they are glass because glass is a lot more food safe, no BPAs are going into your food. This is super nice, I've never seen them do like a food storage container that's glass over here. They have a few other like gardening and plant related items here. So they have these plant markers that come with these really adorable metal signs that say grow your own way and welcome to the garden. And then they also have for a dollar this plant trellis. We kind of saw something similar in the Walmart dollar shop but this one's like a little ladder like a black ladder this kind of helps your plants to grow upwards we did see something kind of similar over in the Walmart dollar shop but this is way nicer because it's actually made out of metal and both of these items are only a dollar they have these two new baskets over here in the dollar spot for five dollars a piece these would be so adorable in like a kids room on a shelf or something perfect for like little toys or maybe like bath time items this part at the top actually feels like pretty waterproof on the inside but then it is woven on the bottom which I think is fine if it gets wet comes in black and white and both of these are five dollars these are super super nice these would also be great for like plant baskets if, if you buy like a tall tree or a faux plant that comes in like a pretty plain base I think it'd be better for a tree because these are like a little bit bigger but these could be great for the bottom of that and super easy to throw it over and they're super affordable they're only five bucks Speaking of five bucks, Target actually sent me a $5 off like any purchase coupon. $5 off a store-wide purchase of $15 or more. I've gotten these a couple times. I don't know like how you sign up to get them, honestly, because it's for a store that I don't shop at. Like it's not my home location, but I do shop at the store pretty often. So I came purposefully today so that I could spend my coupon. It's good for like, I think a month after you get it. And I got this in the mail. I honestly don't know. I think you probably have to have like a Target membership like on their website like an account not a membership just an account but yeah they sent me this coupon which is pretty cool it's smart of them too because i'm definitely going to spend more than five dollars but it gets me to the store because i'm like oh my gosh it's a free five dollars but really it's like 
an advertising like marketing tactic to get me to spend more money, which Target doesn't need to do because I already spent so much money here. We are now going to check out if there is anything new over in the home decor section. Always my favorite part. We saw these eggs last week, but they have an even bigger one. This one's a great size. This one's 15, so 10 for the small and 15 for the big. Oh no, <laughs> what did someone do to her? I got you, Miss McGee. Some new baskets over in the hearth and hand section. This actually feels really sturdy because it has metal on the inside. It is $20 and they are calling it just a tray. Very simple. Good little tray. I feel like this would be a great size for a coffee table basket. You could easily, let me put this up here. You could easily put in like a faux plant, a candle, and then your remotes and it's super functional. We also have coasters in our coffee table basket because we love to use coasters. We like to keep a little stack of coasters in our remotes and it's just a nice thing to have on a coffee table because it can easily look messy and something as simple as a tiny tray like that, which is honestly the perfect size, just makes it look so much more organized and put Together. This tray is really nice too, and this is new to me. It's like a beautiful chocolate brown color, and it's really, really big. This is $30, look how big it is. Hand test. This is a huge tray. This would be perfect for like a dining room table or something. It's a really good size. I love the color too, like the chocolate brown color. I feel like you don't see that very often, especially lately. It's been more about like the warmer tones and stuff, but I really like this for 30. If you like this tray, but you want it in a bigger size, you are in luck because online it actually comes in a bigger size for $24.99. It's only $4 more, $5 more for like double the size tray. If you are interested in any of those, as always, I will have everything linked down below. I'm sorry about last week, if you saw last week's video. Um, it took me a long time to get the links up because the day that I was trying to do it or the two days I was trying to do it, the Target website was like completely down and no pages were loading for me. I tried it on Brian's computer. Um, I tried it in like incognito mode. And I just could not get the website to work. So hopefully everything will be linked down below. I really love this sink caddy. You can put like soap and then your like scrubby brush in there. So in our new kitchen, the sink is actually in the island which i very much do not love because i feel like it makes the kitchen island look very cluttered so i definitely want to get something like this for our sink just to kind of have like one nice place to have everything organized i just feel like it will help with the like clutteredness of like a sponge and like dish soap and stuff I feel like this would help a lot so maybe I'll pick this up this is $14.99 I love this laundry care symbol guide it has like a bunch of different like iron medium low temp I think it's like symbols that you might see on like clothing tags this is so cute it's a really good size too it's 16 by 20 this would be so adorable to hang in a laundry room I've never seen this before I think I want it our new laundry room is really big definitely might see this in my future laundry room because I really like it this little bugger, I have been looking everywhere for this bunny shaped surfboard. Oh my gosh, I really like it. So it had mixed reviews online, but it looks like really nice to me. I mean, yeah, it might be kind of hard to like arrange a cheese board on it because like on the arm and stuff, but I think this is so adorable. This is $15. I really like it. I think it's super fun for Easter. I think that'd be really pretty like up against a backsplash or something. Ooh, I kind of want to get it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, well I have a coupon. <laughs> Literally my toxic trait at Target. But our new kitchen has a lot of counter space and cabinets i just can't wait for you to see it i feel like i'm just like giving the whole thing away um but it has a lot more like like probably double what we have right now in our current place because we also have like a butler's pantry in the new place so that's like another set of cabinets and another counter which i'm fighting with brian to put like all of our appliances over there but he doesn't want to do that so we'll see who ends up winning that debate but yeah, there's just like a lot more counter space and stuff for me to decorate, so I'm so excited. I have so many ideas. In our place right now, I have not been able to decorate the counters at all. Like there's literally not one single decorative thing on our counters because we just have like one little like strip of counter space and the sink is over there. So we have the island and I always decorate the island as you guys know, but now it's kind of different because I have I can't really decorate the island, but I have a lot of counter space I can decorate. So that's good. It'll push me outside of my decorative 
comfort zone, which is what I love about this house so much. So this is actually the knit blanket that I got from the Target clearance store. If you missed that video, I will have it linked down below. There's a store I shop at that's just full of Target clearance, and I found this blanket for 10 bucks, and here it is 70, so it was such a steal. It's in great condition. Of course, I just like washed it and everything, but Oh my god, it's like such a find. It looks so good on the end of our bed and I just love it so much. So that is everything that was new over in the home decor section this week. Now I want to take you over into the makeup section because actually most of my makeup I buy is from here at Target. I am planning on doing a makeup like tutorial, not a tutorial, but a lot of people just wanna know like how I do my makeup, what makeup products I use. So in this video, I'm actually gonna show you like all the makeup products I use because you can actually buy all of them at Target. And then over there, sometime in the next coming weeks, I plan to show you how I actually use it. But I am gonna go ahead and show you all of my favorite makeup products. They'll all be linked down below, and I'll try to give you some little tips along the way. But I get a lot of questions, so I'm not trying to gatekeep. I wanna show you my favorite products that you can buy here. They're all super affordable and amazing, and I love them. So yeah, let me show you some of my favorite makeup products. And yeah, I'm hiding out over in the shoe section. So my Target and some Target locations actually have an Ulta. So my Target has like this really cool Ulta location it's kind of like a mini Ulta but it has all your favorite brands and I have to pick up one thing from in here and then we're gonna head over to the makeup section I need to get a new beauty blender I always get the original pink one I feel like you know they say that they are all the same like they always have different colors like now they have like a black one but they've had like so many different colors but to me the original pink one it's just the best. I don't know if anybody else feels that way. Okay, so over in the makeup section now, I'm gonna show you each product that I use really quickly and it's gonna be shown in the order that I use them. So the exact order that I use these products. And like I said, they'll all be linked down below. And if you have any specific questions about them, be sure to leave them in the comments and I will be sure to answer any questions that you have about the makeup products. Okay, so after I wash my face, put on moisturizer, let that sit in, I put on this e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. It's really affordable because it is e.l.f., but some some e.l.f. products are a little bit more expensive and this is one of them. This is so good. It is a little bit hard to find. This is the only one they have in the store and I'm really glad they have it so I can show you. But this stuff is amazing. It's a dupe for a high-end um, a high end primer, sorry. Um, a lot of the products I use I feel like are like dupes for higher end stuff, but I think they work amazing, so this is the first step. Okay, after that sets in, the next thing I put on is the Lumi Glotion. This is by L'Oreal. A lot of my makeup products are by L'Oreal. I just like their products a lot. They only have the deep glow shade right now. Um, I currently use light, 902 light, but I'm trying to buy 903 medium. It's just always out of stock in the store. But this stuff is amazing. It adds like a really nice glow. A lot of people always ask me like, what do I put on my face? Cause I'm glowing. This is definitely one of the products that helps me achieve that. And you put it on over your primer, but under your foundation. Next up is foundation. And I use the L'Oreal Infallible 24 hour fresh wear foundation. This foundation is amazing. I love it so much it's like medium coverage but it's definitely buildable so you can build it up to full coverage if you want but it's super lightweight it lasts me all day and I think it looks amazing definitely fresh looking fresh wear foundation this is definitely my favorite drugstore foundation it's $11.99 super affordable I have a like darker color and a lighter color and I just kind of mix them together based off of like you know how tan or pale I am and yeah I just love this after I put on my foundation I put on concealer I use the elf camo concealer it is a dupe for the Tarte shape tape it's only six dollars I like the hydrating ones they either have the hydrating or they have the 16 hour camo concealer I just like things more like dewy and glowy so I use this one but that one is really really great too so after my base makeup is done this is what I set my face with it's so freaking affordable it's 579 and this will literally last you forever this this is the Cody Airspun Powder. It is so good. This is just the original formula. It's literally under $6. Like I said, it will last you forever, and it works so, so well. I feel like it's such a good dupe for the Laura Mercier um, powder that a lot of people love, and I just love it. It's super affordable. It does kind of have like an interesting smell, but you get used to it pretty quick. Next, I put on bronzer, and I use this also to like contour my face. I just kind of like pinch my face and my brush, and I'm not very like precise with it. I like a very like airbrushed look to my makeup. I'm obsessed with these Physicians Formula Butter Bronzers. I don't know exactly which shade I have. I actually think it is this one. This is the Brazilian Glow. This does have a little bit of a like sheen to it, but no glitter or anything like that. This looks beautiful 
beautiful on your skin. The Physicians Formula Butter Collection is absolutely amazing. So I use this next after my powder to start adding color back to my face. Next up is this palette that truly is the Physicians Formula All-Star Palette. You could totally skip the butter bronzer and just get this because this pretty much has everything you need. This is the go-to travel palette. It comes with two different shades of the butter bronzer. One of them is matte if you don't want to use a bronzer that has any sort of sheen to it. So it comes with a matte as well as a more like shimmery one. Then it comes with two highlighters and I just mix these together with my brush every single day. It does also come with a face powder and a really, really pretty Happy Booster Glow Blush. This palette is literally everything. This is $14.99 if I'm traveling. This is pretty much what I will take and then my other like, you know, face products and stuff, but this has everything you need in it and these products are amazing. For brows, we're going back to L'Oreal. I don't do much with my brows. I do like this brow stylus definer to kind of just fill it in or I like this brow stylus boost and set. It's kind of just like, I don't know, like a little comb that has like brown makeup on it that I just kind of brush through if I don't feel like spending a lot of time on my eyebrows. And this will kind of fill them in as well as set them in place. So I really, really like this, but I have that too. And then I'm kind of panicking because I don't see these set up as a display anymore, but no worries because I have four of them in my bag. These are the only lip products I use. They're the L'Oreal Paris. I think they're the Satin Rouge Liquid Lip. I will have them linked down below on like Amazon or something, but I have a bunch of different colors. My favorite one is definitely I have no idea if this is gonna focus, but it's called I Rule. I also love I Create and I Choose. These are all so pretty. I have every single color that they make. They're super lightweight. You can layer them and they don't feel gunky at all. I'm very sensitive about things on my lips. I Rule is pretty much the one I wear every single day, which is this one that I get a lot of questions about. So. Here you go, this is what it is. And then I have talked about this before, but to set my makeup, all when I'm done, I spray this actually on my beauty blender and kind of press it into the face because I have eyelash extensions, but if you don't, you could just spray this all over. It is the Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. It's not meant to be a makeup setting spray, but this is what I use. And I think it just like makes everything really meld together and look super beautiful. There it is, there you have it. There is every single makeup product I use every single day. Honestly, I don't change up my makeup routine pretty much ever. If I ever want to do eyeshadow, I will just use one of the bronzer colors and the highlighter just to kind of like put something on my eyelid. But with eyelash extensions, I try really not to do that. And I don't use mascara because I have eyelash extensions. But yeah, there's all my favorite makeup products. And like I said, if you have any questions, definitely let me know down below. But that is going to be it for this week's Target Tuesday. Well, alrighty, you guys, that is going to be it for me. I really, really hope that you enjoyed this week's Target Tuesday. Please be sure to let me know down below what was your favorite item I showed in today's video. And while you're down there, leave that key emoji if you're really excited for all the new home decor content that is coming. Literally, as you are watching this, we probably have just gotten the keys to our new place and we're filming our empty house tour. So get excited for all the fun home decor content that is coming up over the next few weeks and months. I mean, it's a really big house, so I know it's going to take me a long time to get it all decorated. So if you want to come along in that journey, be sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every single time I post a new video and make sure you give the video a big thumbs up. But that is going to be it for me. I love you all so much and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!